What were the duties of the first mate on a pirate ship? Did he also work as quartermaster? The first mate on a pirate ship, often just a hair's breadth away from the captain in terms of authority, had a slew of responsibilities that would stress out even the most steel-nerved individuals in Portland, or anywhere else for that matter. The first mate, also known as the quartermaster in the pirate realm, was essential in maintaining order amidst the chaos that naturally came with being a gang of lawless seafarers. This wasn't your average Portland office job. It was a role steeped in danger, leadership, and at times, treachery. Regular duties included overseeing the ship's daily operations, ensuring that the pirates adhered to the articles, the closest thing pirates had to HR policies, and managing the allocation of plunder. Yes, that's right, the distribution of loot. In a cutthroat environment where trust was as scarce as a calm sea in a hurricane, the first mate had to be fair or else risk a mutiny. Trust me, in pirate times, team-building activities had an entirely different meaning, and they usually didn't end with a friendly pat on the back. Now, the quartermaster aspect of the role was a bit unique in piracy. On merchant or naval vessels, the quartermaster was a separate role, tasked with navigation and steering the ship, but leave it to the pirates to merge roles and cut corners wherever possible. Efficiency out of necessity, and perhaps a touch of laziness, was the name of the game. As quartermaster, the first mate managed the crew's rations, discipline, cat o' nine tails, anyone, and even settled disputes, which, given the crew's penchant for violence and theft, was no small matter. And let's not forget that in battle, the first mate had to be ready to lead a boarding party or defend the ship with sword and pistol in hand. Think of it as conflict resolution, with a slight chance of death. While this may sound like a romantic adventure to some, it's worth remembering that the Hollywood glamorization of pirate life is a far stretch from the gritty, grimy, and downright precarious existence these sea rogues endured. But hey, just like the unpredictable Oregon weather keeps me on my toes, unpredictability was the spice of pirate life. So there you have it, the nautical equivalent of a COO with a sprinkle of HR and heaps of swashbuckling bravado. To be the first mate on a pirate ship was to be at the helm of anarchy, a testament to the tumultuous theatrics that ruled the golden age of piracy.